And mm-hmm. they each had their own individual umbrella because it was kind of misting that day. Not raining, but like <laughs> they were ready for it. <laughs> oh, yeah. And I, I look at them. You want them to sh- <laughs> you say it like it's gay, but it's more gay to share an umbrella. I mean, all right. So, so hear me out here. It's gay to you, use an umbrella. you wear an umbrella in Glasgow. You're a dead man. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> you can't riot with an umbrella. Like, like, are you here to do business or not? You know. Like, like, yeah, I, well, I, sometimes Antifa will get the big black ones to stop you recording. This was yeah, the one your aunt has in her purse. Like it folded out to about this big, yeah. and it, 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 it was probably like this when it's all folded up. And uh, I go, guys. I broke character. I was like, guys, it's not raining, you fats. <laughs> <laughs> and, and they both they go, oh, oh, and they undo their umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> they they undid their umbrella when you when you call them out. Yeah, damn, they, they need to have the courage of their wasn't convictions. Raining at all. Mustache is a, looking thick, looking good. I like it. We had oh, someone man. from the Dick Universe on your show, on our show. That what was there? Autistic boobs or something? Mint. Oh yeah, mint. Mint nice salad. set of boobs on her. Oh boy! I, yeah, I swear her OnlyFans name was. I'm close to it though. Like autistic boobs. Am I crazy? Mm. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's yeah. autistic boobs. Autistic. Yeah. Yeah. How did she get yeah. looped into your world? Well, you already uh, saw the tits. So, <laughs> so <that's laughs> we opened the door. Takes. I don't know what <laughs> your criteria is for. Guests. Oh yeah, I I do recall. Like I used to see a lot of posts for, from you. About that Japanese woman who has the most uh, bafflingly Taylor, big tits. On, baffling. I, baffling. I know. I, They're I've great. Stared at, I've stared at him for many hours to try to figure out the mystery of Hitomi Tanaka's tits. <laughs> <Tell me Tanaka. laughs> I'm going to be an old man, like trying to decipher the Holy Grail, just looking at how are What's they. What's her so name? Big. I need to Google her. Hitomi Tanaka. Man, it, I, there was the two saddest days of my life. The second saddest day of my life was when she retired. And the most saddest day of my life was when I found out she's has a boyfriend, oh, and that he's boy. some fucking white schlub from like Northridge, which is like twenty minutes away from me, who plays in some mid band. I'm like, oh man, that could have been me. Yeah, that could have been you, dude. Oh, damn. You like probably boobs this big? Needs Maybe like I'm gay. I, I'm, Little, they're not my cup of tea. Well, you she are gay. In that photo. Uh, yeah, you are gay. You're, you're, you're always talking about thighs and being a southern girl and stuff. You're 100% gay. Dude, you can't get them to shut up about being a southern girl. <laughs> 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 it's all day, every day with this fucking guy. He's going to start working in like a little handkerchief and going uh-huh. like, oh, mercy. Me. Our last like, guest slowly, was like, like stars and garters. He was talking about how gay someone was for holding an umbrella. And I'm like, God, the list keeps growing. And to, to avoid being gay is... It's difficult. Yeah. Gavin How do you hold the umbrella with your head. asshole? You're not allowed to have an umbrella that's gay. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's gay. That's true. I mean, the, I thought just not fucking guys was enough. <laughs> but no, I didn't yeah. realize. Are you how kidding? Complicated that's the straightest was. thing there is, Woody. Uh, uh, are you, are you saying gay guys are in prison? That's crazy. That's the straightest guys there is. They're all fucking each other. Well, one side of them is very straight. Yeah. The mm-hmm. the the dealer, as they like dealer. to be called, like mm-hmm. the you know the receiver, very gay, because yeah. that just means he wasn't powerful enough or didn't commit a threatening enough crime. Kyle would have been a receiver. He would have in, when Kyle was in jail. Oh yeah, yeah for weed stuff. Oof, yeah. He would have oh, pre jail, post jail. He'd have been, been the deliverer. That's rough. Yeah, yeah. Um, Kyle knows who who Tommy Tanaka is. I bet best boobs in the world, Kyle. Who, who are they? Who do they belong to? It was Eva Green for me for a long time because I saw her in that, I uh, can't remember the name of the movie right now, The Outsiders or some shit. And uh, she, she has full frontal in that. She like, you see her vagina very clearly. And I saw that on HBO when I was like oh. 13, 14, 15, somewhere in there. And uh, so it's been Eva Green for a long time. Then I saw Monica Bellucci in uh, the second Matrix movie. She's wearing a latex dress. And I okay. went down a whole rabbit hole with her. Okay. So These you're days? into like uh, celebrities, uh, women, boobs. Where I else get, would I go? Like sports or something? Porn, porn stars only. I get oh. kind of uh, uh, annoyed at like like celebrity women, famous women. I don't even really think of them as like uh, on the level of attractiveness when I'm thinking. Mm. I just go straight to porn stars because like celebrity women, it's like you just, you know, you're keeping it all under wraps. Kind of being a cock. The chicks like, I, I mentioned don't... are the ones who throw it all out there. Like Monica Bellucci is the chick who gets butt raped and irreversible. Like she's got no shame. 
You Maddie, oh, really? Yeah. This one. Oh, I think you I'm sound like a guy who carries an umbrella. I'm a little bitch who carries an umbrella. Oh, <laughs> fuck. I'm going to have to eat that tonight because, <laughs> because, <laughs> you can't because I will not be an umbrella guy. No chance. No chance. Wait, are you, how often are you carrying an umbrella around? You I haven't like... carried an umbrella in 10 years, but I reserve my right to. Uh, you got a sodomy clock for that? Like Milo, Yiannopoulos? <laughs> what? About sodomy, sodomy clock? clock? Milo, he's like, you know, he's a. How long it's been since you've taken it. one? Yeah, up to ass. Yeah, he's got it. He tweets I about it. He wasn't my gay favorite anymore. thing. Well, he's, he's not gay anymore. He's he's uh, you know. I don't think he's gay. <laughs> no, that's you. That, you go to hell if you're gay. He's not going to hell, so he's not gay. You also uh. go to hell for lying <laughs> about being gay. <laughs> so, <laughs> Look, he's not fucking guys in the ass anymore. That's all I know because he got the. Well, clock how does the sodomy clock work? Uh, like the way a tornado trailer park clock works, like no dick in the ass since this date. And then you count like, how long has it been? Oh, I think three years. Oh, he had a relapse one day. I was like, that was a great day. I mean, (laughs) but I was like, Oh, he's being honest about this shit. Oh my God. And now I'm glued onto the Milo sodomy clock. If I ever see it, I'm like, Oh, give me, let me take a look at that. Wait, Milo had a clock that kept track of his sobriety from being fucked in the ass. And then he, came clean about getting fucked in the ass yeah you had to reset it one day that's All right. fantastic you know, i love this I, it's awesome man i've got to i've got to respect it you I, know I, now i want him. a fucking sodomy clock i'm gonna start doing it so i could have one that'd be so funny if you're like i've been doing it for 41 years and then one day you just get online and reset (laughs) (laughs) isaiah thank you for joining us that was an insane sentence to come in on (laughs) good to see you how's your shot of me clock i don't want to get you know personal i don't know you i i I haven't checked it out in a while but it was good last oil change so (laughs) is it you should know right away (laughs) (laughs) do do i use an umbrella i try i've been trying to quit so (laughs) yeah gavin mckinnis said that we were gay if we used umbrellas and don't own one i don't use an i don't even own an umbrella i kind of respect that i kind of get that a little bit you know like if you're it's because oh, Gavin's shit. got all that goo in his hair, right? Doesn't he have slick back hair? <laughs> goo, he does. is that what he is? He, yeah, so he's got like a I'm a goo man. Umbrella. Maybe it's just what because he doesn't use an umbrella. Maybe that's what it is. Ah, oh, that's yeah. clever. Man, there's an actual account called Sodomy Clock. I can't <laughs> yeah, believe this. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> May 15th. Get them cool. as a sponsor. <laughs> that would be so cool. <laughs> Are you Have addicted to having your the- asshole plundered? <laughs> <laughs> well, we can help. Well, it we depends on the definition of sodomy. It's it's also oral, technically speaking. No, get yes. real. I'm, I'm just yeah, letting you know what the laws say. Right. Yeah, but that's... Next time you're anti-sodomy, you just know you're down to vagina. Yeah. We, we know well, what I mean, it really we, means. <laughs> when the good, how would the Lord feel about uh, oral penetration? Would he think sodomy? Uh, with a clock, he probably wouldn't approve of it. If I had to guess, you know what I mean? But, yeah, you're fucking a clock. You're, you're, you're losing on all fronts here, Taylor. I'm, I'm, you know, what? I'm so sad about that that I'm sure he's at least a little sad. The laws <laughs> of man and God alike are, 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 are against you here. Well, when you know, you're wrong, you're wrong. I guess it's funny because right before this, I was recording the weird Bible show, so it goes <laughs> from like parables and Jesus immediately like sodomy, Windigoon. How do you? confer how do you <laughs> how do you confer? i mean old testament god notoriously unchill with it it very, hated very it and chill with it yeah jesus just had so much more stuff on the list he was trying to get to there was huh. a lot he was huh. you know he was fighting pharisees and he like had the whole dying thing to go do so that took up a lot of his mm-hmm. time yeah. yeah yeah he had a lot of a lot of people coming after him because he ruined their bank the, the the temple they were using for money changing yep. not good not good you gotta be uh, you gotta everyone knows church is for a guy in jeans who knows three chords yeah. on an acoustic if, if, we're, if we're gonna steal people's <laughs> money we're gonna lady. do it our way okay we're gonna do it with with speakers and have like these big projectors and stuff like that yeah